the other night on on television we watched as the lady game cox kept us in suspense for a little while that was uh 87 to 75 and that was a that was an exhibition of great skill great competition practice determination precision and all of that but the score was 87 to 75. Now go over to Darlington. A lot of times the race is a little bit closer than that. Mm -hmm. And the, the, uh, the, the lead changes often. Back in 2003, there was one such race. Of course, it was 400 miles. The average speed, counting the, the flags and all of that, was 125 miles an hour. That's the average speed. Ricky Craven and the 32 Pontiac beat Kirk Bush in a number 97 forward by how much? Two one thousandths of a second. Now that took skill, that took preparation, and as Peggy and I have, have walked around the, the infield as the race was going on and in preparation, you see the, the pit crew, for example, they're out there practicing the moves, picking this up and moving it over there. And you see how they, they practice get get the flow just right because it might be that one or two two thousandths of a second right there that wins that race. If you want to see a bunch of trained, skilled, determined people chasing perfection, that's where you go. Go to go to Darlington and watch that race. That's why we're so thrilled about it. It adds to the excitement of South Carolina as part of our fabric. We got golf, basketball, football, gardens, history. We got everything, go to the mountains, the beach, and all of that. But if you have not been to Darlington and seen these races, then something's missing in your excitement portfolio. So I recommend that you go because Peggy and I will be there with you. Thank you.